old, 79. How does it feel to be 79? Crazy, because my body's 79, but my spirit's 26. What is something you thought was really important when you were younger, but as you got older, you realized it wasn't that important? Probably money, even though it matters, makes it easier, but it doesn't guarantee joy. Good health is important, and luckily I am blessed. Have you ever lost someone you really love? Yeah, my husband. We were together 43 years, married 38. We had a great life, but it ended. How did that impact you? I was sad, but life goes on and you have to make the best of it. A lot of people aren't able to move on though. How were you able to move on from that? I guess just inner strength, not wanting to be a victim. It's not what happens to you, it's how you handle what happens to you. What is something you really wanted to say to him that you never got a chance to say? Wish we had more time because you never know when it's going to end. So you think it's going to go on forever and then it comes as a surprise. So if you could go back in time and have a conversation with your younger self, what would you tell her? Appreciate every day. Don't take things for granted. What is something you thought was really important when you were younger, but as you got older, you realized it wasn't that important? Material goods and more money than one really needs. As a younger person, I think, you know, we tend to want to make a lot of money and acquire a lot of material things, have a big house, great car, all those things. And, you know, I realize that's not what life is about. Life's about your relationships, love, and being able to know what abundance really is and what enough means and having enough. It's peaceful. I love being peaceful. What does abundance mean to you? Paying the bills when they come in the mail, wanting what we have so that we don't want more, and more than anything, relationships, quality relationship with family and friends and yourself. Life's simple. It's not that complicated. And the, the more complicated we try to make it, the more peace you lose, right? I mean, simplify. That's where we're at. I got a beautiful wife. I got a great family. I've got my health. I've got enough money that I don't have to worry about things. It's not like we're, you know, billionaires or multimillionaires, but we're totally fine. And, um, and it is enough.